Hello there fellow moth fans. Today will be a treat for you because a beautiful African uh, Saturnidae just hatched that I haven't shown on my YouTube channel before. It is the Lobo Bunea Fedusa from Africa. Uh, the eggs from this particular moth they came from Ghana in Africa. And these moths uh, can stay dormant for a long time in their pupa waiting for the next rainy season to arrive and increased um, humidity and temperatures trigger them to hatch and the captivity if they don't like the conditions they can remain in their pupa for a long time I had to wait for this beauty about one year before it decided to hatch uh, it was interesting you will see that it closed its wings because this species when it's resting it actually folds its wings together but if you bother it ta -da, it will open the wings and show its beautiful eyes so in order to make videos like this you will have to harass it a little bit hope you guys don't mind now look at these eyes you know my favorite types of moths are the kind of moths that have red eye spots it just looks so intense and colorful plus it's rare to see really pure red on insects like this and it's a very large moth too oh it's starting to go to sleep again as you can see it has some nice patterns on the underside of its wings that help camouflage it see and now it's asleep again from the side it almost looks like a dead leaf or a piece of tree bark and this is how it rests but when you bother it boom here come the eyes beautiful I'm really really privileged to be able to breed this beauty in captivity now there's some other good news let's place you against the wall for a second here because Yes, you're beautiful. Okay, let's now you do I suppose one more time. Oof. Wow. There's some other good news. And the good news is babies. And this plastic container, you can see little yellow caterpillars. Maybe it's hard to see because I left the lid on. That's alright. If you take it off you'll see many little caterpillars and these are the caterpillars of the same species so if I'm lucky I can raise all of these to big moths like the one over there it's going to be one nice breeding and thank you for watching everybody I appreciate your viewership bye bye